As people are leaving, law enforcement agencies are stepping up patrols in Clackamas and Marion counties. The Marion County Sheriff's Office says it arrested two men today for looting in the Saniam County, excuse me, in Saniam Canyon, as many have evacuated their homes. Let's check in now with Fox 12's Sarah Hurwitz. She joins us now with the very latest from the Sheriff's Office. Sarah? Yeah, the sheriff's office says that this all happened at about 10 o'clock this morning. They got a report of a suspicious van in the area of Detroit. They say uh, that this van was actually seen earlier, uh, that fire crews had reported seeing it in Idana, and that they were concerned that it was connected to looting. Now, the sheriff's office uh, says that deputies did locate that van near Gates. They say it was driving at a high rate of speed. The Marion County and Lynn County Sheriff's deputies pursued the van as well as Oregon State Police were helping out westbound on Highway 22, taking the exit towards Staten and Sublimity areas. The Sheriff's Office says that the van actually drove through a golf course and then deputies deployed spike strips and were able to stop the van. The Sheriff's Office also says that the two suspects ran from the van. They were eventually taken into custody. And take a look here. The Sheriff's Office says that 21-year-old Anthony Boda and 36-year-old Alexander Jones are facing several charges, including attempted theft and burglary. Now, the Marion County Sheriff's Office also says that there were several uh, items that were recovered from that van. It also says that it is going into public safety override. It says that it will be holding, keeping those two people that were arrested in custody until a judge releases them. The sheriff's office was clear today that they don't want to have uh, people be further victimized who have already lost so much. Reporting live here in Salem, Sarah Horwitz, Fox 12 Oregon.